Hello everyone, welcome back to English lesson with Madam Wu. This is CFR Year 3, Unit 1, Welcome, Lesson 2. The materials needed are a notebook and a pencil. We are focused on numbers up to 100, have got questions, and yes or no answer. Let's start our lesson for today. So first of all, let us look at the vocabulary. So look at the numbers here. We are going to learn numbers in tens. So first, ten. Ten. T-E-N. Ten. Twenty. T W E N T Y, twenty, thirty, T H I R T Y, thirty, forty, F O R R T Y, forty. Okay, look at the spelling of forty. It is F O R T Y. So don't write it as F O U R T Y. It is wrong. Alright? Bear in mind the correct spelling for 40 is F O R T Y. Next, let us look at 50. F I F T Y. 50. 60. S I X T Y. 60. 70, S-E-V-E-N-T-Y, 70, 80, E-I-G-H-T-Y, 80, 90, N-I-N-E-T-Y, 90, 100, 100, Okay, next. Shells. Shells. Since we have more than one shell, so we have to add S here. Shells. Teddy bears. Teddy bears. Zigzag puzzles. Zigzag puzzles. Alright? So these are the vocabulary that we need for today's lesson. Let us move on to have got question and yes or no answer. Alright, let us look at the pronoun over here. We have pronoun she and he. She and he is used to refer a singular subject. Alright, she is used to refer to a female. For example, a girl. A woman. Okay. He is used to refer to a male, a boy, or a man. So we have to use has. Has she got 20 shells? Or has he got 20 shells? If she has 20 shells, we say yes, she has. If he has got 20 shells, we have to answer, yes, he has. If she hasn't got any, we have to say, no, she hasn't. If he hasn't got any shells, we have to say, no, he hasn't. Alright? Next. Look at the pronoun here, you and they. So they are plural, right? They are used for plural subject. So we use have. Have you got 20 shells? If you have got 20 shells, you have to answer, yes, I have. If you 
haven't got any shells. You have to say no. I haven't. All right. Okay. Have they got twenty shells? If they have got twenty shells, you have to answer yes. They have. Otherwise, you have to say no. They haven't. Okay. Let's practice. All right. Look at the pictures and the questions here. Has he got ten cookies? Let's count the cookies. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Yes, he has. He has got ten cookies. The second examples. Has they got twenty balloons? Let's count together. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. Oh no, no, they haven't. Right. Let us look at the third examples. Has you got thirty candies? Have you got thirty candies? Let's count candies together. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four. Oh no! I have only got twenty-four. So the answer is no. I haven't. I have got twenty-four candies. All right. Has she got ten flowers? Has she got ten flowers? Which should be the answer. Let's count together. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Oh no, she hasn't. No, she hasn't. She has got seven flowers. All right. Okay, you are required to complete two tasks. First, spell correctly based on the numbers shown. Second task, choose the appropriate answers based on the pictures. Okay. Click on the link to start. All right. That's all for today. Thank you for watching.